Hey everybody, it's Chainsaw Reacts. Guys, let's not waste any more time. Today they released a behind the scenes video for Justice League. I'm so excited. I got off Twitter as soon as it was put online. I'm like, holy crap, I'm getting offline. I don't want to see anything. I'm here. I'm finally off work. I'm here now. Let's react to it. Justice League behind the scenes video. Let's see what they show us. Let's get into it. Let's go. There is a stranger who comes to this village from the sea. He comes in the winter when people are hungry and brings fish. Comes on the king tide. That was last night. Ooh. Talk. Yeah. Talk. Ooh. <laughs> oh. Oh, I like that. Oh, dude. Everybody just waving at the camera. Oh, that's awesome. Ooh. Training. Whoa. They're getting thrown in the air. Oh, that's the throw. Okay. Batman jumping up. Ooh, that was the tactical suit. Ooh. Oh, this is awesome. Oh, <laughs> he took her sword. Thanks to my cast and crew. It's been a great shoot, and thank you, UK. It's been amazing. Oh, my gosh. Wow. That was freaking awesome. Wow, they showed a bunch of stuff in there, man. A lot of, you know, them goofing up, but they showed some really cool shit in there. <laughs> it just makes me happy. You know, everyone has their opinions on BVS, Theatrical Cut, Ultimate Cut, Suicide Squad, and Warner Brothers has been saying that they're trying to change the course of the DCEU. I call it the DC Cinematic Universe. They call it the DC Extended. It's the cinematic. I'm loving this. I'm loving this. It's not revealing too much. It's just giving us a little more. The trailer, trailer, basically just Comic-Con footage as they called it, was just a bunch of stuff put together with a repeated thing from a song, a repeated section from a song realistically. Um, this gave us some of that at the beginning and then had all five of them standing together coming down an elevator. Is that the Batcave? I hope so. Um, it's just cool to see them goofing off and seeing how these films are being made because we see behind the scene featurettes being released for films usually right before or after the film has been put out. I think the Civil War behind the featurette came out a couple weeks before or maybe it came out after, I don't remember. But this has come out over a year before the film comes out. This film doesn't come out till November of next year and we get a featurette. So you know they're gonna heavily market this thing, so we're probably gonna get a trailer, official trailer, like a teaser, next year at some point, before Wonder Woman, and there'll be a big trailer for Wonder Woman. They're continuous, I didn't expect them to put out something. I, don't, I think this was put out for New York Comic Con. I don't know, but I love it. I love this, I just love seeing them have fun, I love teases of stuff, them walking up some stairs together, that was badass as shit. And Batman jumping down. Two different shots of Batman jumping off a ledge or jumping off something and going down. It's just epic because it's fucking Batman. Obviously. Fan of Batman. Um, seeing the other characters. Seeing uh, Ray Fisher. I believe that's his name. Ray Fisher who is cyborg training. Pretty awesome. Seeing Just seeing Jason Momoa in the Aquaman suit is just awesome. Just seeing him in that armor is just freaking awesome. Seeing... Um, Ezra Miller, yeah, as Barry Allen, the Flash, seeing him in that suit. We saw him in the suit for like a couple seconds in Suicide Squad, but seeing him in the suit looks pretty awesome. Of course, Wonder Woman. We've already seen Wonder Woman in BVS and in the trailer for Wonder Woman, but it's still cool to see her with these other characters. I'm excited. Are you guys excited? I hope you are. Um, yeah, as soon as this thing came online uh, today, I got off Twitter, and since I got off Twitter, they released the Legend of Tomorrow trailer, which everyone's freaking out about, and they re and then uh, Aldo Jones released a uh, weird trailer for for Star Wars Rogue One, so a lot of stuff, so 
that is my thoughts. The Justice League featurette, behind the scenes, whatever you want to call it, it's still an awesome video. I like what I saw here. I like what they showed. I like the fact that they didn't give us too much away, but the stuff they showed us that were new teased. Like a couple seconds, boom, it's off. So you don't really get a lot of context. It's just random shots, just building hype. I'm ready. I'm ready for this film. I wish it was November of next year. I wish. But there you have it, guys. Let me know in the comment section below what you thought about this Justice League behind-the-scenes video. Can't wait to hear your thoughts. Thank you so much for watching my reaction, guys. Peace out.